Let's start with viewpoint settings. Go to viewpoint panel and our error is this area. And first we know that using orbit we can look from here, from here, but in camera settings we can align camera, align, align camera to X, align camera to Y, it's OK, we can see it. But we don't see axis now and we can turn off view and x y axis now we can see it so x is here y is here and let's back to viewpoint and if you want to look like a plan align to that one let's back to y and another valuable option is the type of projection now it's orthographic we can change it to perspective then back. It's a very interesting option and we can use it with the show grid mode. It will be next. And so now let's go to align Z and in this view you can try a very interesting, interesting option. Camera, small button and here there is a roll, roll tool. Now we're pressing the left button and it looks like the model is moving, but not the model is moving. Our, our position is moving, so our side is moving. So we change the camera position now. Let's back to the Y one and let's try a roll here. We can roll and roll back to use the position what we want. So it's a very flexible thing and we can make any kind of position to make a, our viewpoint and to save it in any position. And next interesting tool uh, we have to use only after changing the projection to perspective and now it's active and we can field we can change the field the seeing field now we observe about 26 percent of our scene of our model of, of, of our model if we say hundred now we can see hundred percent of our model and all of it all of it elements if we want to see only 5%, we can change it like this. So it's a very interesting instrument and tool to, to manage the position of your camera and to zoom your model. And so with all these tools, you can make any kind of position to your model and to align your camera to any axis.